Hello, my name is Lawson, and I will be your WOD coach for January 23rd, Friday, or Friday, January 23rd, however you want to look at it. Um, and I'm kind of dubbing this time as Mindset Friday, because if you're like me, um, the battle for success, um, probably anything in life, but especially AdvoCare, um, is fought ground zero in my thinking, in your thinking. And so... Um, I have loved the the tangibles, the um, the the work um, coaching that's come before me, and that's been huge for me. I love that. Thank you for that. Um, so, but today Friday is about thinking in the brain, and so there's really two categories of people that will probably be listening to this. Category one person is someone who, man, is strong in belief, got that down. More than likely, you're a leader. Um, and 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 have been able to cast vision and hope well, um, and so um, that's that kind of person. The category two person is someone who is working on belief in themselves and struggles more times than they would probably like, and wakes up more often than they would like, and wonders if this if I can actually do this if if I have the ability and that, that confidence in themselves to present this amazing vehicle, which is Avocare. And so I'm going to spend more, most of my time talking to the Category 2 person, maybe a little bit of the one person. Category 2 person, two thoughts for you. Um, when you're in that place, if you're in that place now, um, my encouragement to you would be to plug in to the person that first captured you in Avocare. And I mean, when I mean captured, I mean they painted the vision and they painted hope for you. Because more than likely those are the two things that really got you to where you're at right now. Hope and a vision for something more, for something greater, for something um, maybe even more fulfilling than where you're currently at. And so I would just encourage you, plug back in to them. Two and a half years, two and a half years, it took me to believe in myself, and I had multiple people in Avocare as mentors who believed in me way long, long, long before they ever, before I ever believed in myself. Um, and I promise you, if you're in that boat where I was, and and sometimes, many, many times, I am still. Um, I promise you, someone right now is believing in your capabilities and your strengths and your character long before you do. And so that's kind of encouragement number one. Encouragement number two for you is sometimes it we need to take a break from sitting and thinking and wanting to believe in ourselves and trying to have right thinking and trying to package it all in that space, which is me, which is I'm really kind of talking to myself. And sometimes you need to put hands to the plow, head down, and just go to work on the basics of Avocare, connecting people to your story, connecting them to their products, painting hope and vision, and then inviting them to see more. That's it. Just put hands to the plow. If you do that, if you're in that place, if you do that, you're going to look up and go, man, I'm in such a different place than I was a month, two months, three months ago, because I just put hands to the plow, didn't look back, and just move forward. And so those are my kind of my, my two encouragements for for you guys. Category one person, strong in belief, confident, knows what they're doing. Um, two things. One, I would ask that when you read books, because more than likely if you're in that place, you have read a lot of books. Please, please remember that reading them, yes, you want to personally grow, but read them in such a way that you're always thinking who needs to be bestowed, passed forward the knowledge that I'm getting right now. Who on my mind, who's hitting my heart, who's striking me right now that needs to read and hear what I read just a second ago. And think of that person and read books in such that way because it will not only bless them, but it's also going to bless you as, as well. And then kind of number two for that category of person who's strong in belief, got it rocking and rolling, is never, never, never wake up and assume that all of your team members are 
rock and roll, and even if their numbers, even if the fruit that they're bearing is going really, really well, never assume. Always get an opportunity to um, to instill that hope in, into people, and so um, um, and, and instill that vision into people. So, boom, mindset Fridays, go rock and roll, instill hope, instill vision. Um, we all need it every single day because vision leaks. Vision leaks. So, thank you.